Harry, first of all, welcome to Hibs. Congratulations on the Muse. How excited are you to be here? Oh, absolutely buzzing. You know, it's an um, incredible club to, to be at and, you know, it's only really sunk in the last few days. Um, but yeah, now that I'm here and meeting everyone, and, yeah, beautiful facilities and really buzzing to be here. And tell us about those last few days, because as you said, it's been a bit of a yeah. whirl, whirlwind. Yeah, it's, you know, there's been... Obviously, Ross I had to like finish things with Ross County, but we had to do it in the right way. Obviously, I don't want to you know, annoy them or anything because it's an amazing club, um, beautiful players, beautiful people. Um, but yeah, only the last few days has it really sunk in that you know, coming to a club of this stature and you know, it's just still only just sinking in really now, but now I'm really pleased to be here. Yeah, and um, what was it about the club that attracted you to come here? And like I just said, like the size of the club, you know, big stadium, playing in front of more fans, you know, compared to, to uh, Ross County. But obviously now that the new manager's coming as well, it's enticed me a little bit more, you know, the way he wants to play football. Um, and yeah, I think it suits my suits my game, whether he sees me, you know, right, right centre back, right back, you know, left wing, he can go anywhere. But um, yeah, no, uh, buzzing to be here. Yeah, and as you said, it's obviously an exciting time to join with. Sean Maloney joining at the end of 2021. What kind of conversations have you had with him so far? Yeah, I spoke to him uh, just about two weeks ago and, you know, he explained his, his way he wants to play football and, you know, that straight away, you know, appealed to me and I said straight away to my dad and we had, had a conversation with him and, like, straight away you could tell he's you know, very football intelligent. Um, you know, he knows the way he wants to play and he wants to dominate football and he seems really passionate about winning and that's, that for me is enough. And in terms of yourself on the pitch, what type of players uh, can Hibs fans expect from you? Uh, I've got pace. Um, you know, initially I was a centre back. Well, I started off as a striker um, back in the day, but found my way at centre half. So, uh, you know, I'm defensive minded, but recently I've been adding, you know, goals and assists to my game. So they can expect a lot. Um, you know, I expect a lot of myself. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, like you said. Centre back can play striker, can play yeah. in the midfield. You started your career as a as a midfielder or striker, and then obviously at Ross County you were um, playing right back. Where do you think is the most effective position for you? About two weeks ago, I would have said centre back, but now it's right back. It'll probably change in another two weeks, but um, yeah, no, I think right back for now. Um, you know, I feel like I can really use my pace there. At centre back, I feel like I'm a bit limited. Um, but yeah, as long as I'm on the pitch, you know, I'll, I'll play as well as I can and, you know, I'll do everything for the team. But um, yeah, right back. And in terms of your career so far, we mentioned Ross County there, no stranger to the Sins Premiership. How was that experience um, up in Dingwall for you? Yeah, amazing. Um, I think, you know, there was a few doubts going up at first. Obviously, it's right up north. I've never been that far. I've never even been to Scotland, let alone four hours higher than that. Um, but a beautiful place, really beautiful people. Not a bad word to say about the club. Um, run by amazing people. Um, but yeah, playing in the SPFL has been amazing, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, massive platform. I didn't really know much about Scottish football before coming, but really glad I went there. And yeah. Mm -hmm. And so first half of the season made 17 appearances for Ross County, three goals, two assists. Can Hibs fans expect that? A defender, you can be as effective in our own box, but also the opposition's box. Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, that's, I want d at least double figures, goals and assists, if not more. Um, you know, I set myself targets. I didn't actually think I was going to score a goal, let alone, because I scored one last year uh, when I was on loan at Oldham. Uh, I just wanted to beat that and, you know, I've already done that. So now I've got to push on. And, but yeah, no, fans can expect one end I'll defend for my life and the other end I'll try and score goals. So. And before Ross County, Obviously spent time at Arsenal in a youth academy, signed a professional contract there and on loan from there at the moment. How much have you learned from training in that environment? Oh, amazing. Um, loads. I think the last two years I've really integrated into the first team, training with them. So just training with them guys, being around them guys, you learn the tricks of the game and just watching them every day, how they, how they work, how they train. It's, you know, it's, well, one, it's a dream come true and obviously two, you, you learn so, so much. And you mentioned some of your ambitions and goals to score, double figures, goals. What are some of your other ambitions for your time here at Hibs in terms of where you want the club to go and how you can help them? Me personally, I just want to keep ticking games off. You know, game time is the most valuable thing. I want to stay fit and tick as many games off. Um, like I said, goals and assists and also clean sheets. But for the club, I think Europe is the main one and hopefully we can chase third place down and 
we never know where we go from there. And obviously, you've played against Hibs this season. What have you made of Hibs' first half of the season so far, and, and how can they kick off in the second half? Yeah, I think I made my debut here. Uh, came on for the second half, and I thought, you know, it's a, I know it's no fans, but amazing stadium, uh, amazing pitch. Um, and then we played up in Dingwall recently, um, and I think the way they play football, you play, you guys play football, well, we play football, I should say. Um, yeah, it was amazing. So it was, a, it's a joy to play against them, but also now that I'm here, it's really good to be involved. And just quickly, you mentioned that this is your first time up in Scotland playing football or just ever. What have you made of, of the country and how are you enjoying life in Scotland? Yeah, amazing. Um, yeah, and like I said, I never even thought about Scotland or, you know, watched Scottish football really apart from the, you know, the Selwick so Rangers games. Um, but now that I've been here, it's amazing. Um, and yeah, now being in a city like Edinburgh and a club like Hibs is dream come true. Well, it's great to have you here, Harry, and best of luck with it all. Lovely, thank you.